Hey guys, it's Tim, and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to port forward for servers such as Minecraft, Terraria. Uh, those are the mains that I know how to do, but uh, this will probably be kind of generic, so you can probably do this or get the general idea for almost any other server. So, the first thing you're going to do is um, click start, type in cmd, and open up your command prompt type in ipconfig and you should get all of this you're just going to go to the top and you'll see default gateway and you want to memorize that or you can just leave it up so open up your browser of choice click up in the search bar and then type in that so oops 192.168.1.1 and hit enter and you probably will not be logged in so it'll prompt you to log in um, usually the username is admin and the password is admin or it's nothing but you can just look up um, your specific router and it'll give you a default list of usernames and passwords unless you changed it yourself so um, not all routers are the same so this will be different for almost all of you unless you have the same type of router as me but you want to look for something called applications and gaming or gaming or something along those lines and then you will click on that and then you will get pretty much something um, looking similar to this so what you want to do is um, name it so just minecraft if it's for a minecraft server or tf2 if it's for a tf2 server I, this probably doesn't know i don't know how to do a tf2 server but just an example and then external port and internal port um, and this is always 25565 or that's at least how I've been taught to do it. It might be something different. I don't know how that works, but just do that because it works. I've used servers with this, and that's what you want. And then protocol. Um, if you have the option to do both, do both. If you do not have the option to do both, you're going to have to make two. So like this. And this one will be TCP, and this one will be UDP. And it'll just activate them both. But um, since we have both, we'll use both. So cross that off, and we'll use both. And then um, IP address right here. You're going to have to put in your IP. So um, uh, IPv4 address, um, you will use the last three numbers of your IP. So mine is 15, so I'll just put 15 there. And I will check it, and I will put save settings. But um, it's the same thing as that one, so obviously it's overlapping. But that's not going to happen to you because um, you won't have two, you have one. So that's basically all there is to it. Um, it's really simple, just might take a few tries to get it by yourself without referring to a video. But hope this video helped. Um, if it did, leave it a thumbs up and comment and subscribe. So thank you for watching, and I will see you next time.